Good Wednesday morning, 94.5 with the Surf Rider Morning Surf Report. Hard morning, Staff Sergeant. <laughs> Staff Sergeant. A small cluster of meteors is predicted to enter our atmosphere. Scientists are scrambling to try and understand it. Evacuations are now underway. Uh, two or three meteors just impacted. Oh my god. It appears that there's something like shadowy uh, figures. I think I'm gonna head back now. Everyone needs to get out of here right now. Lucas, if you could just come back, please. Oh my god. I wanted to do an alien invasion movie in the style of like 28 days later. It appears our initial assumptions were wrong. He shot Aaron in a short presentation that he gave to the studio. And it was like you, you were plopped right down in the middle of a war. My favorite genres are war movies and alien movies and uh, Battle of Los Angeles combined both of those and I remember reading the script and thinking it's the exact type of movie that I love to go and watch and have dreamed of directing and I remember the day I got the, the day after I got the job I woke up and I couldn't believe you know that I had the job it was unreal where did it come from? Oh, what do you see? I don't know man what's going on? how do we get out of here? And I wanted to feel like, you know, there's shadows and is there something there and there are alleyways and, you know, all sorts of... We did a lot of, you know, driving around Venice and Santa Monica and, you know, looking at some of these, you know, smaller streets around near the ocean and getting a sense of, you know, the alleyways and overgrown brush everywhere. And I'm thinking there could be an, you know, an alien there and there and there, you know. I don't think the script can contain all the energy that's going on in these, in these circumstances. So... You know, and these guys have great imaginations, you know, so we're always finding new things to do, and Jonathan likes to shoot a lot, um, and we're finding a lot of those magical moments in between the lines in the script. Um, you know, once you get it and your body starts flowing and your blood starts pumping, you know, plus the fact that, you know, we're, we're shooting not live rounds, but we're shooting dummy rounds, but with, with real weapons, we have tanks, we have um, grenades, and all this stuff is going off, and, and so all those juices are flowing, and... Um, you know, so there's a lot of good stuff in here. Once I found out that they were shooting it documentary style, I knew that there was going to be long takes, and I knew that these actors were going to have to live the whole thing. We weren't going to take an actor out and stick Stuntman in there for the most part. And it was so realistic and raw and authentic, so it wasn't, it wasn't glossed over, it wasn't, you know, clean. It was, it was as if you were right there in the middle. So I instantly was completely excited to be part of it because I, I knew he was going to be capturing something we haven't seen yet. At 1446 Pacific Standard Time, 12 different locations across the globe were breached in what appears to have been a coordinated attack by an unknown enemy. This is a textbook military invasion. We are the last offensive force on the West Coast. We cannot lose Los Angeles.